flash floods washed out some of the roadways and trails like the Greenway right here in Raleigh. I found out what crews are now having to deal with. Monday storms caused several roads to look like this one in Harnett County washed away by the heavy rains. Over in Johnston County, the Department of Transportation says they had to close more than a dozen roads. The damage that happened in Johnston County to our state maintained roads actually was worse last night than during Florence two years ago. DOT spokesperson Andrew Barksdale said the storm mainly caused lost pavement and shoulder damage. That just shows you how crazy a flash flood can be. No one was really predicting a major amount of rain in such a short amount of time and it hit parts of Johnson County really hard. He says the unexpectedness led several agencies to form together. Tuesday's been a day of assessing the damage and strategizing the next steps. Although not as severe, there's still cleanup underway in Raleigh and Wake County. Part of the Greenway by Crabtree Creek washed away and is closed. Other areas are in need of power washing. City, county and state crews now working to make the paths and roadways safe. We need to get roads reopened or cleared or fixed as soon as possible, and that's one of the things that we uh, really strive on. That's a mission critical part of our job. As always, follow these signs and do not go past the barriers. For more information on the latest closures, just head over to our website, click on this story. Reporting in Raleigh, Bridget Chapman, CBS 17 News.